Father, we ask for forgiveness from our black brothers and sisters for years and years of racism. Okay. cannot oh bro this this is uh, this is ridiculous okay <laughs> this is honestly maybe though one of the most stupidest videos i've ever reacted to him i swear bro when i seen this i was bro i was in disbelief that these people is really this stupid all right look i'm done talking okay we finna go ahead and get into the video but i need y'all to do me a big favor first i need y'all to hit that like button subscribe turn on post notifications what y'all doing bro we so close to that big 70k all right 100k next year man so i need y'all really do me a big favor go ahead and support the channel without further ado let's get into this crazy crazy video bro <laughs> Humbling ourselves before you. Yes, Lord. You brought the thunder and rain today, God. Because Satan takes an L today. Father, in Jesus' name, you get the victory. Father, we ask for forgiveness from our black brothers and sisters for years and years of racism, of systematic racism. We know he's been God and he no longer can be here. We get honor and like Bro. <laughs> this is. This is the dumb. Okay, I'm a, so the video is in loop. Now I want to I want to watch it one more time, y'all. We're gonna watch it one more time to to really to really just let it sink in how stupid this video is. One, just one more time. We know he's been guided. He no longer can be here. We honor his legacy. We're not rioting, God. We're not shaming anybody, God. We're just humbling ourselves before you. Yes, Lord. <laughs> You brought the thunder and rain today, God. Because Satan takes an L today. Father, in Jesus' name, you get the victory. Father, we ask for forgiveness from our black brothers and sisters for years and years of racism, of systematic racism. Okay. <sighs> hey, I cannot. Bro, America is just a funny place to be, and I swear, I swear, bro. There's so many people in America that is honestly hilarious. I think some of you people should be like freaking comedians or something, bro. Are you serious? One thing my mama always taught me was, yes, always apologize for things that you have done that could hurt other people. Keyword, always apologize for things that you have done. I will always take fault for my actions because I'm humble and I believe that we should all take accountability for our actions, but I'm not to take accountability for another group of people that did something that i didn't do i'm sorry that i'm white if you hate me because i'm white then what, what so what i didn't ask to be this color and i'm not white i'm just saying this for the white people but just like a person who hates a black person and what you gonna do that i'm black what what you gonna do i can't i can't i i can't take my skin color off what you gonna do you see i i can't do nothing what, if you hate a black person because of what a black person did to you, I didn't ask to be black and I'm not them. Bro, that's like me going to apologize for a whole community, to a whole cu a community and say, oh, I'm sorry that my black people done did this to your, com uh, to your uh, freaking uh, business or whatever. When the looting was happening, I'm not going to get on my knee and bow down to no human being for some mistakes that another person done did. I understand that that's within my community. My community is known for this, but at the end of the day, I am not this. I, I, I may be, I'm not saying I'm white, but I'm just saying, for example, I may be white, but that doesn't mean that I'm a part of the white community because maybe y'all see the white community as this, right? Y'all think all white people is racist, but I'm one of those white people that's not racist. I love you people. I love all people. That's how I look at it. And for them to get down on their knee and do a prayer and, and bow down, kneel down in front of these black people, crying and doing all this and saying, Father God, forgive us for all this. Forgive. I appreciate the prayer, but the prayer could have been done in another way. The prayer could have been done separately. I'm not going to be the only group of people. I'm My people is not going to be the only group of people bowing down. Because it looked like I'm bowing down to y'all instead of bowing down to the Lord. Because they all standing up. 
they all bow down. If you're not a part of something, why are you apologizing for somebody else's faults? We are all human. We all make mistakes, but I'm not going to sit there and take on somebody else's mistakes. I'm not finna baby somebody else because of their mistakes. There's a lot of things wrong within the white community. There's a lot of things wrong within the black community, the Hispanic community, the Asian community. There's a lot of things wrong with each and every community of race. And I'm pretty sure they got people in their community that's like this and like that and like this, but I'm pretty sure one individual or multiple individuals not gonna take on the faults that people view their community as. Let's be real, bro. This is ridiculous. This is seriously ridiculous, bro, that y'all gotta apologize for something that y'all probably didn't even do. And I get it. I get what happened to George Floyd. I get it. I don't wish death on nobody. I don't. Don't live George Floyd. I don't live. I'm not going to sit here and, and hate. At the end of the day, the man is deceased. And I'm not going to speak on the dead. I'm not going to talk bad about the dead. So at the end of the day, it's going to always be long live George Floyd. I'm going to stay on that. And that's what everybody that died. Anybody who died, black, white, it don't matter. Lonely, it don't matter what their lifestyle was on here on earth. At the end of the day, they passed away, and now they in the afterlife, okay? They either in heaven or hell. I'm going to be real. They either in heaven or hell. That's all it is. So I'm not going to sit here and talk bad. So for them to bow down and say and apologize for what happened to George Floyd after they didn't even do what happened. None of these people, none of them, kneel down on George Floyd until he was there. None of them did that. So why are y'all apologizing? Like I said, honestly, it it is what it is. But nobody should take the fault of another human being. I'm sorry. Nobody should do that. You should not feel entitled to be to sit there and take somebody else's faults. We all deal with our own problems. Why am I going to take on somebody else's problem? I'm not doing that. God called me to love everybody, but he never told me to take on another person's problems. Because they, because if, if my community do this, God never said, you have to be the one. We all have to be the one to take on what the community of people do. No. If I was white and and uh, mostly white people, not saying they are, but mostly they, they claim to say all white people are racist, which I know that is false. But they claim to say that. So if y'all see all white people racist, it's always a lot of white people in the community that's not racist. It's a lot of white people that's not racist. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this uh this situation. This is this is dumb. I'm sorry. This is stupid. This is honestly this is foul. This is foul. I'm sorry. I'm I'm, I'm sorry. It's foul. I don't care. I don't care who you are. I don't care what you say. This is foul. I'm not bound down to nobody. That's dead. That's dead. You ain't gonna make me look like I'm your pet. <laughs> you got me messed up. Like I'm not no, that's dead, bro. I'm not bound down and apologizing for my skin color. I didn't ask to be this color. If you don't like me, if you don't like me because of my skin color, then oh well, so be it. I'm still here living. You better do something about it. If you don't like me in black, oh well, so be it. Who cares? Who cares? I ain't here for your approval. I'm here for God's approval. I'm trying to please God, not you. It don't matter what you, you know what I'm saying? It don't matter. I'm not bowing down to you because of what somebody else did to your people. I'm sorry. Who do y'all think y'all are, bruh? <laughs> y'all thought this was cool? Y'all thought black people was going to accept all y'all for doing this? They still hate y'all to this day. I don't. And there's a lot of black people that hate white people. I'm not part of that group, okay? I'm not part of the people that hate white people. I love all people, regardless of your skin color. I don't care what color you is. God called me to love all people, so that's what I'm going to do. I don't care what you've done to me. I, I still love you. Still love you as a brother and sister in Christ. Let's be real. Anyways, like I said, y'all let me know what y'all think about the situation in the comment section below. <laughs> this is hilarious. I love y'all. God bless. Stay blessed. Peace.